Hi, in this video, I'm going to show you how to bulk create in Canva using a CSV file. So first, create the image that you are wanting and the fields that you will know you're gonna to wanna to fill. Okay, so this is what my practice one looks like right now that I wanna bulk create. Then over here on the left-hand side, you'll find bulk create. If it's not there, listen on all your options, go into apps, it will be under your apps. Then you're gonna click bulk create. You can either enter the data manually, which you'll find a lot of videos on YouTube on how to do that. But here I took my CSV file from Norwex and now I'm going to upload the data. So simply find your CSV file on your folder and select open. Then it's going to ask you the names, first name, last name, title. These are just some of the data fields that I have put into my data. And then I'm going to click continue. Right click on the element of the page to connect your page. So what I'm gonna do is first name, Jennifer Bradley. So I'm gonna come over here. I'm gonna click the three lines over here. I'm going to connect the data and then it's that simple. Whoops, maybe if I can slide over correctly. First name. Then I'm gonna come over here. This is the last name. Click the three dots. You can put any kind of data in that you want. Um, I have this is the kind of information that I'm going to just be showing you here an example for this. And here I'm going to add the title. Um, you don't have, like I said, these are just extra fields that I'm showing you how simple it is to add um, different fields onto this graphic. And then over here, I'm going to connect the data for the finances. And again, simply click connect data, personal sales. So my graphic is finally all set, ready to go. Um, there might be a little bit of error here with the sizing of that so I'm going to spread that out a little bit there um just a little bit on this side just to make sure that the data fits for how I want it to fit now everything's done I've connected my csv file to the boxes on my graphic canva and then I'm going to go ahead and click continue and then it's going to show me all of the images that it's going to create for me it's going to create 89 pages in about seconds so I'm going to click generate and then your computer will automatically fill in a bulk edit in Canva. Over the years, my team and I, especially my leaders, helped me put images into my Canva folder. So we have three different folders from like A to J, J to S, and S to Q or whatever, or Z. And then my daughter, that is a job that I pay my daughter who is 13 to do. So what she would do then is then she would come in over here on the side I have in projects. And then if you select your folders, you'll see that I already have my folders created with all of the consultants in there. So then she would basically very easily come in here to J to M and then she would just, I, we have them saved as their names. So it's very easy to find. And then she would come over here and move them in. And all you have to do is little click on the little three dots. Once you type in Jennifer, we just have a lot of Jennifer's on our team. And then that way it fill it in. Okay. So then she goes through and manually adds in the pictures, but you can see right here very quickly. Then all 89 of these graphics are filled in and ready to go. We take personalization and recognition on our team very seriously and shouting people out. And so um, this is, these graphics are very easy to grab. And then to also even send them a little text message with their graphic saying, oh my goodness, good job. Thank you for being part of my team. You've engaged this month. So this is how we choose to recognize and shout out um, our team. I don't always put the total on the engagement picture. Uh, a lot of times what we do is, let me see if I can go back to home here real quick and just show you. <clears throat> I should have this folder ready so you can see. But if they don't want to submit a picture, because we definitely have people who don't want their images shared on any kind of social media platform, we use a pet to dry. Let me show you here. So here, for example, are the people that were all engaged in last month in March. And it's thinking about opening. Sorry about the delay here. It doesn't, I mean, I guess when you have that many images, but I'll just show you quickly on an overall view then um, what it looks like to just have a whole bunch of people. So when we when they first join, we say, welcome to our team. We do, we love to shout you out and recognize you by your image. We ask them, do you have a favorite image you'd like to give us? And like I said, I work together with my leaders on this so that it's not just always me um, trying to connect with everybody and get images. Um, and then we also, if, they, if they're engaged, 
or and they just join and they don't really give us one we don't really force it but you can see here becky didn't want to do a photo or maybe she was brand new and she hasn't submitted a photo yet and so then that's when we will just drop in a simple um pet to dry for her spot for an image so a simple way to just like i said recognize shout out again that was a bulk editing in canva and if you haven't started yet with your images of your team just start slowly and just focus on each month the ones that engage or the ones that have top sales and focus that way and start putting them into folders by abc order and then by their first name or last name however you like to organize we do first name here and then that way you have a folders ready to go in Canva. We do team on Canva. So I have five other leaders that are in this group with me or four other leaders in this group that are with me. I'm the fifth one. I believe that's how that works. Um, and then they can also help put folders, images into the folders as well. So that's something that we love to do. And a very, 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 very quick way on how to um, link your images, connect the data, and you know automate, as Debbie Bolton always says, what can you automate in your business? Have a great day. Keep it joyful. Keep it clean.